Why did you want to do this? Was it just for fun? Because oh, it looked like fun. Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> yeah, well, I think it's such a fun and also because there was no... They've done quite a lot of these before. Yeah, they did a yeah, caravanning yeah. thing and the barge and thing. The barge thing. And, it, and it just seems like there's no cynicism, there's no eviction. No, there's no, no competition. There's no, no agenda going no, on. So no. it seemed like it would be genuine fun. And I used to go camping when I was a kid. A long, long time ago, and it was very different. So I thought it might be nice just to get out of London. <laughs> it was lovely. It was some yeah. fresh air. The thing is, though, on this program, like every day, we were packing the tents up and moving on to another site and having a different tent. And that's right. not what you do when you go camping. No, indeed. You, you put your tent, tent up and you stay and there. There you are. And you had a cardboard tent. Yeah, had a cardboard it didn't rain. Tent. Did it? Uh, well, we didn't use them. <laughs> a little bit. It was a little bit smelly that one, wasn't it? And yeah. it was tiny. Yeah. But it no was windows. great because we had lots of different types of tents. Right. Um, and we, we were moving quite a bit, which made made it a bit more exciting. So are you so experts now? A lot of gloves. <laughs> no, <laughs> we were experts. Sadly. And also we were lucky because the weather's fantastic. Yeah. And I think if the weather's great in this country, then you wouldn't want to go anywhere else. I agree yeah. with you. You're absolutely and right. And with camping, you can just throw your things in yeah. your car and you can just go. Can't and the you? countryside. Oh my yeah. word! Yeah. I didn't know what, that Dorset was so beautiful. It's beautiful. And the Isle of Wight, yeah. absolutely oh. stunning. And also. Um, we had the campfire. We cooked a lot of food by the campfire. I mean, so you had Cheryl to do all your brilliant. own cooking. You yeah, do yes, that. yeah. And Cheryl, Cheryl was good. she's automatically the maternal one, really. And and uh, you used to have a cookery show, didn't you, long, long time ago? Oh yeah, yeah. There isn't yeah. anything yeah, that this woman hasn't Before done. Before you were born, probably. I can't tell you. But we also um, had locally sourced food. Right. And I'm a veggie, so I thought it'd be really difficult. But it was amazing. We had yeah. loads of Crazy. vegetables which we just threw on the fire. Yeah, it was yeah, great. Yeah. And we talked. We all talked and sat around a campfire. So you didn't have your phones. Nobody was sick. Because that's the worst thing, isn't it? Everybody now, when you when you look at yes. people, and I hate that when I go to a restaurant and see people, they're all on their I know. phones. Because they're basically saying this is more things. interesting than you yeah. sitting in front of me. But we did have our phones. They well, we never used them, really. We never used them. Ah, we literally, I mean, we'd photos. sit round yeah. the fire of an evening and, just and we would talk and laugh and play games. Jeez. It was fabulous. Yeah, Did you all know each other beforehand? No. 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 I, I felt Bobby. like I knew you. I you mean, two we've, really We've clicked. been around quite a long time together. <laughs> we felt like I knew you. But as soon as we met, and obviously we were the only girls as well. Yes. But, uh, but we did bond. We had a laugh, yeah, didn't we? Did. We? we did have I, a laugh. I knew Bobby. Davro, yes, before, of course. But I've never met anyone else. And now we've got our, our little WhatsApp group, and we're always great. connecting via You can WhatsApp, keep in touch so. with one another. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, look, when you're camping, it does get a bit basic as far as going to the loo and stuff like that. I know like what that. you're going to say, Shadow, Lorraine. Shadow, no, no, this is this is wonderful. This is ingenious. What you did <laughs> because you're so thoughtful that you didn't want to disturb anybody. <laughs> so tell us what you did, rather than getting up in the middle of the night and disturbing everybody. I was everybody asleep. To go was to I asleep when this happened? Yes. Is this what I think it is. And Stephen <laughs> Bailey. The three of us were in the tent and I had my own little section you know when you zip up a little nylon zip thing and it was pouring with rain outside really heavily raining and and the and the toilet block was quite a way away so I thought I'm busting for a week so I thought what can I do mm. so I took my t-shirt off right and I weed on my t-shirt did you yeah how considerate of you I know don't attempt this at home not. maybe not something that everybody should do <laughs> and we slept but all the way through we, that, that meant, well, we found out the next day but if Cheryl had got up and gone to the loo and, miles and away, zipped and you would have woken up genius what t-shirt was it was which one was it did the one that I wore on that field yeah the one you wore the next day I'm sure that's been <laughs> or at least it's been washed 20 times. Put it in the wash. But it is ingenious and it was really nice of you not to wake us up. Oh, I was oh, like, I'm like that. <laughs> I can't help <laughs> noticing these earrings. They're amazing. Oh, they're You've great. got fizz on them. Where'd you get them? They're great. I've got them in New Look. Oh, and my really? daughter, my daughter saw them. They were very expensive. They were £1.50. You might Excellent. get 500 cents to you now. <laughs> I, I hope so. You're off cruising as well. I do a lot of those things, yeah. yeah. I do my one-woman one, one, one show, yeah. And, and you're on holiday at the same time, so you can combine know, work with and my husband. Ah, it's fantastic. Win-win. And I get paid. Well, happy win, win, win. Days. Oh, I want to go on a cruise. And Michelle, we can see you on stage soon. Uh, I start rehearsals uh, on Monday for a play at the Park Theatre called My Dad's Gap Year, so I won't be cruising. No. I'll be cruising in Finchley no, Park. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> and do you know what? We obviously have seen you in EastEnders, we've seen you in Corrie. You've got to go for Emmerdale. Get the three. Oh, I knew you were going to You've say that. You've got to, Michelle. It's got to be done. <laughs> or Hollyoaks or something. So you can get, get the full house. Because nobody's ever, nobody's ever done that. We'll see. I, I did a Even though we walk I, on. I, I like to be a bit more... So I did a, you know, a drama called The Queen of Mysteries, which is coming on next year for US networks. So right. I just like to be a bit of a jobbing actor. Yeah. I mean, it's sort of... And different, was, different roles, yeah, different parts. Yeah, I don't like to be tied down too much. OK. So we'll, we'll just see, get you in the wheel we'll pack. See.
asking for a drink. <laughs> just to say that you're there, I just think it'd be brilliant. Get you in every single one, every single okay, store. Okay, I'll and then, picture and then go to I'll pretend I'm there or something for you. Okay, <laughs> really good. But look, meanwhile, we can see you in this fantastic thing this evening, which is just a, basically Eight a o'clock, I think, Channel 5, yeah. It's yeah. on for four weeks or five? Five, five, five weeks. Yeah. And it's five great weeks. fun. And hopefully people watch it and go, we're going camping next year. Yeah. Well, why not? I mean, we, we, had, a great, great we had a great summer last year here. Yes, so exactly. hopefully we'll get another really good summer. Yeah. No, and then people can do staycations. Yes, but pop-up tents are definitely the easiest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go for the pop-up.